Yes, Ooh. ladies and gentlemen, that is yet another night of satisfied customers. Hey, Cat, good job tonight. You know, we're really starting to get into a little groove here. Hey! Oh! Oh! Come over. Okay! Okay! We like his aggressiveness a little bit. Hey, yo! What? I mean, AP, you could go on the hand. I mean, you don't got Mary Jane. I mean, Gwen is um, <coughs> Gwen, but you know what I'm saying? You're free. You're free. How's it going, Squad Nation? It's your boy. And today, we are back once again with another video. And today, I, I, I mean, at this point, all y'all should pretty much already know about the fan film Spider-Man Lois. Like, Spider-Man Lois is by far, you know what I'm saying, one of the most hyped up releases of a Spider-Man fan film to this day. It's how it's even more hyped up than any Spider-Man theoretical official release, uh, period, which is insane because a lot of people was covering it. Andrew Garfield, the, the, the you know, the, the person who played Spider-Man, the Amazing Spider-Man uh, movies, both one and two, and also John Watts, who was also a Spider-Man, um, I believe a director. But all in all that, um, uh, a lot of you guys don't know is that, though obviously there has been a whole bunch of drama with that whole like fan film, everything, you know what I'm saying? The racism, the all this stuff like that. But now as the, as the thing finally released, and the crazy thing is it premiered, literally had a whole theater, everything premiered for it. Uh, I'm not actually going to be reacting to this uh, film, at least not yet. Actually, the film in general is two hours long. So even if I could, I'll have to like cut into a bunch of pieces and do it that way. But instead, I'm going to pretty much react to a fan film that I'm pretty sure a lot of people... I, I've already brought into the fold already, but I'm just going to like try to like, finish as well. And that is... Peter's Web, which is the uh, definitive Spider-Man fan film, at least for me, because, you know, saying, even though it's completely out there. Also, before I even um, continue onward, um, I do want also very much appreciate to a handful of, a lot of you guys, because for, for the most part, I have been going crazy with the Spider-Man content as of late, because again, I have covered, you know, say I went deep dived into the Ultimate Spider-Man stuff, covering Spider-Man versus the Kingpin, Craven, Doc Ock, and even Green Goblin. So again, a massive shout out to you guys for giving me this love and support again. Like I said, as someone who was pretty much was constantly covering other stuff like Webtoon content, and then just switching up to Ultimate Spider-Man and stuff. Again, whether, you know what I'm saying, again, I was literally just making it that sound that whether or not those videos are going to do good or not, I just wanted to just do them because, you know what I'm saying, again, I'm a Spider-Man fanboy, I love Spider-Man, love his comics, love his movies, video games, you name it, I pretty much have been part of it. But all in all, uh, but yeah, and, and even now with the fan films. So, uh, just do note that I will plan on making like a review for the Lois video at some point, because again, like I said, I haven't watched the film yet, so, and as far as the reviews go for the film, it is not <laughs> a lot of people is lately dog shitting on it. I, don't, I mean, mainly it's because of uh, the races, the whole drama that came with it. Kyle plays a massive role with it. But all in all, um, I'm going to just re react to it my own damn self as a Spider-Man fanboy. I might as well at some point. But all in all, uh, we'll, just, we'll save that when we get to that. For right now, we're going to react to pretty much the peakest of definitive version of pretty much any of the Spider-Man fan films, possibly the best of the Spider-Man fan films to this date, and that's Pierce Webb. Again, like I said, I hope, hope that they ever, if they ever get the chance to, I'm not saying that they should, but if they, if they ever get the chance, I would love to have it be HD remade in some form or fashion with new age technology and stuff like that. Some of what happened with you know, inspire me loads and stuff like that, but again, don't want to hold my tongue. Anyways, not, I'm, I'm done rambling. Let's just get started with Pierce Webb. Alright, here we go. Man, it's been a bit. It really has been a bit. Oh, the black cat? That shit's the black cat. Okay, buddy. So let's recap. 
you try to get away from me. I beat you up, and now I'm rubbing you up. And now you get to go to jail. Congratulations. Bro. <laughs> no, the, the clip is crazy. Oh. Oh, damn. Stay here. Again, for those that are like looking at this and being like, bro, what the frick? Lady? Damn! She looking fine! Well? I mean, uh, freeze! Just <laughs> A little bit too late for that, my guy. Take it easy, lady. I'm your biggest fan. And I gotta say, I've seen oh you Oh my god. Yo, be a better man than me. Hold on a second. <gasps> oh god! <laughs> Not the boys! Oh, nice heritage. Come on, bro. That's just playing bad dirty. Freak. <laughs> yeah, right, Parker. You're such an idiot. <laughs> right? <laughs> but again, as you guys know, like the hey, what's up, buddy? Um, the quality of this fan okay? film is a little bit the outdated, stress, but listen, the story Jonah is still hits. Jonah's driving me crazy. Yeah, I know the feeling. Well, I got some time. What do you need? Well, do you think you can put these into the data tracking system? Sure. Is that Betty Brent? The freak. Just classified ads and such. Do you need help logging them? Nah. I can figure it out. Thanks, Pete. You're my hero. <laughs> I mean, he kind of is. He is the hero. It's like Pete. Go ahead. All right. It's nice to have one person in the city see those What kind of freaking stuff is it, honestly? Dog. Dog. Oh my god. What? Spider, I would like to see you again. Meet me tonight at the same rooftop as last night. Hey, yo! She already know my man's place of occupation? Okay, Shawty, damn! What? This is insane! Okay. Keep your distance, lady. Second of all, putting that huge ad in the newspaper, it basically told every villain out there, hey, come try and kill us. And third, look, Spider. I just want to apologize for the bro. Hmm. Bro, see how you're working that shot. Damn. Well, okay, I guess. But this is what I don't understand. Why do you do all this? The whole thief thing. I mean, do you really need all the crap you steal? What gives? You wouldn't understand. Try me. <laughs> okay. Long story short, I mean, hey. my father did this. Yes. He was killed by one of who? It was his passion, so I took it on. This is all I know. Yeah, I think so in in the comics, you could help people. I mean, the the whole I mean, the whole origin story of the Black Hand entirely is a little bit retconned in a few areas. One per, one reason is because she does because her father does it back in the day. The other reason power. is. A word at least was completely retconned. Okay, well, let's see no, that's kind of is a retcon. I don't you know. But basically, the whole, yeah, another reason why she becomes black is because she was huh? oh, great. Yeah, I mean, so not, right? that's she pretty much like. Me what? So she was she was oh, training to kill this dude that was graping her, but eventually yeah. she decided to like fill that hole yeah, right. of killing instead of stealing you because the guy already died or whatever. All that. Oh, Lady, your wish is my command. Wanna get stuck with this? Hey, yo. You know what this can do? Woo! Okay, so they're actually teaming up on them. Okay! Bro, that is wild. <laughs> yo, that's Life cool, bro. Like. We save everyone, no matter what the situation. Think of it like the food chain. Scumbags go for the helpless targets, we go for the scumbags. It's simple, bro. but important. It's so cool that Pierre is actually training. Because we do see this, obviously, in the old comics. Hey, and obviously, in the uh, Marvel Spider-Man PS4. Um, Jeez, so the, uh, the, 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 the prequel. I think they call it. It is prequel comics, yeah. It's prequel comics to the, to the you know, stuff like that. I think it's called Black Cat Strikes. Pretty much showcase the whole, like, situation. If he had met Black Cat, now he kind of like try to turn into a horse. Good. Hey, you know pretty little girl follow the rules. We won't have to cut that pretty little face in here. <laughs> God damn, all right, buddy. Bro, literally looks like a hillbilly. I'm sorry, bro. Like, bro. <laughs> Hello. Bro. It's just you and me now, darling. What the hell? Change the plan, yeah. <laughs> I like yo, yo, he has the accent and everything, like, bro. Good job, Spider. Ditto, Cat. Now, what do you say we go take out Frankie the Scumbag's entire drug warehouse? Hmm. Yeah, I, I really like this. He likes this. 
that fucking they're stuffing stuff in the toy. Mario. What's up, it's Frankie. Yeah. No, I'm down at the warehouse. These guys, man. It's just it's insane. So bro. Slow. Whatever. It's be... He got the source. Oh, here comes, you know what I'm saying? Here comes the heroes. Hello. Spider and cat. Oh. Damn! I'm not gonna lie, it's black hair look fun in this shit. What the yeah, hell? You have fun. <laughs> oh shit, one more. Yes, Ooh. ladies and gentlemen, that is yet another night of satisfied customers. Hey, Kat, good job tonight. You know, we're really starting to get into a little groove here. Hey! Oh! Oh! Come over. Okay! Okay! We likes his aggressiveness a little bit. Hey, yo! What? I mean, AP, you could go on the hand. I mean, you don't got Mary Jane. I mean, Gwen is, um, <coughs> Gwen, but, you know what I'm saying? You're free. You're free. What secret identity? I, I gotta think about this. Keep it on. My mask? It would be exciting. Peter, come on, bro. Clap them cheeks. You know, I think it's official. You're a genius. Hey, we love to see it. We, we W is. W we can all catch W's with this. Hello. Okay. Thanks. See ya. Oh wait, hey, this guy called for you earlier. Said it was urgent. Didn't leave a name. Who is it? Break. Wait, little Peter Parker isn't becoming a little homewrecker now, is he? I seriously doubt that. <laughs> Thanks. I mean, hey, you don't, you don't know. You don't know. For real, for real. Okay. Oh, is this? Yo, I, I remember. I think I remember. This is uh, Reed Richards. Mr. Reed Richards coming in. Have an introduction. Peter, I'm glad you called. Who is it? Yo, it's a yo! I'm contacting you because we need your help. We don't have much time. I really think you might have me confused with someone else. No, he know. ain't confused. Peter, I know you're Spider Man. <laughs> yo! Yo, this is, this is, I think this is, they're, they're tying this with Secret Wars. They gotta be. Hello? Cat, it's me. Spider, where are you? I'm just downtown. Look, you something sure? really oh, big is going on. I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I have to bro. go away for a while. Away? You better not be billing on me. Of course not. Look, I'm not even supposed to be telling you this. But there's some kind of big thing going down involving all the top superheroes. Yeah. Secret be Wars, bro. It, it. Let's go. I appreciate it. Then afterwards, it's obviously, Peter's going to gonna get the freaking black suit. I mean, and it was, oh Captain my America's God, it's going to go, go hard, Captain bro. Captain America? Yeah, Captain freaking America. Well, I'll go with you. I don't think you can. They handpicked, like, a bunch of us with certain powers. <laughs> I'm not even supposed to be telling you. Shh. I'm sorry. Don't be. I'm proud of you. Hey, you yo, just gotta police the w, w, bro. Damn! Yo, I really do appreciate what they're adapt they're, they adapted the part black hat, how she really got her true superhuman strength and shit like that. It's crazy. What's the matter? Because for those that don't know, uh, I, I'm pretty sure I, I, you know what I'm saying. It matter if I show this or not. Basically, Black Cat pretty much um, went to Kingpin, and basically Black Cat got like superhuman powers. But the problem is that where's Hammerhead? The oh, da damn! Where's Hammerhead? Ooh, yeah, yeah, yeah. She's working with oh god, she's out here scraping my man's up. I can't tell you, he'll kill me. All right, all right, I'll talk. I'll die. Yo, she crazy with me. Damn. Okay. Everything you'll need. Yeah, but like I said before, like, I'll even though, yeah, her powers got amp, that she got like amp to it, but also caused her to have bad luck. <laughs> Excuse me. She also has bad luck. 
My God. And now for Sweet our top-breaking story. Our heroes have returned. Captain Ooh. America, Iron Man, the Fantastic Four. <laughs> I can't believe they. Well yeah, they actually showed off Robert Tuss. Return from an undisclosed location today after being gone for nine days. Avengers frontman Captain America states that they are back and will resume their duties of defending innocent people worldwide. On an interesting side note, several New York locals have taken notice to a change in our very own Spider-Man. There is yeah, no- Yeah, the black suit, boy, let's go! Oh, you looking nice! Not exactly. My other suit got trashed on the Beyonder world and refound this crazy compound that became this. Yo, it strengthens my powers fire, bro. I've never felt this good. Yo, look at Black Cat. She out here Well, hands yo, 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 yo. <laughs> yo, we love to see it. Wait, let's see this baby in action. Oh, 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 there we go. That'll go. That's as well. What the heck? Oh, God. What the frick? Oh yeah, the black, the the bad luck stuff. Yeah. Woo! Welcome up, Spider. Yeah. No sweat. Yeah, the bad luck is kind of like kicking in and stuff. That's crazy. Spider-Man, we're back in action. What are you talking about? Didn't you see me? I was all over the place. This doesn't make any sense. Really? I didn't even notice. Oh yeah. Thanks. Hey, how'd you get so fast anyway? What's it matter? What's it matter? Mm. Okay, okay. There you go. So maybe when you're gone, I picked up some superpowers. From where? Wilson Fisk. Wilson Fisk, the king. Yeah, of the like bro, that I'm not gonna lie, what bro. Kind of she, 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 but she yeah, did because she was like, wanting to problems, have an edge and pretty much, you know what I'm saying, fight crime more effectively with the Spider-Man. But hey, retard status down is there. Is. Uh, well, I probably don't know how to control him just yet. Sounds like sabotage. Maybe this is a sabotage. What'd you say? Forget it. I can't believe you're working for the kingpin of crime. I'm Damn, sorry. just a snap. What are you, stupid. What is wrong with you? Why are you acting like this? It just pisses me off to know that as soon as I go off to help the good of mankind, you go back to your old ways. Old oh, ways? Damn. I did this for you. Who's you, the spider you keep referring to me by? Or the real me? Peter. You know I care about you. Just put your mask back on and let's go patrol. Yeah, put my mask back on. Because no one wants to be seen with a nerd like Peter Parker. That's not true. Jesus yes, Christ, it is. yo. The black you know suit's what? already affecting him like gone. this. It's crazy. I found something that does care about the real me. Something? What are you talking Forget about? Forget it. You wouldn't understand. We're out of here. Bro. Where? Wait! Sorry, Cat, but making deals with a murder doesn't impress us. Uh, I mean me. Whatever. I'll deal with her later. Man, this suit is amazing. I've never felt this alive. Fighting alongside the bro. best of the best on another planet. For <laughs> Not gonna lie, bro. I mean, I don't remember in the amazing, because in the amazing comics, like, it, in these comics in general, <laughs> when Spider-Man Spire wore the black suit, he never really, I mean, yeah, he shows some type of so aggressiveness and stuff like that, but the actual, like, Full like 180 change, like him being super freaking like you know what I'm saying, over aggressive, overly confident, overly over the top, you know what I'm saying, type B. Pretty much came, pretty much originated from the 90s, and then it just carried over to the same Raimi Spider Man 3. Then after Spider Man 3, it carried over to the freaking spectacular Spider Man. It's just, yeah. Right now. I really don't care. Yeah, I'm not gonna lie. That's looking. That's still looking fire. Oh. Oh, is Samuel gonna do a thing? Is the sit? Oh, she, she's is the symbio about to do the thing? Because for those that don't know, the it all this also happened in the comics as well. Basically, the symbio obviously again is is freaking sentient. It's alive, no duh. Uh, it basically every time, uh, every time Peter tries to go to sleep, it actually bonds with Peter. Oh, God. so fucking freaky, bro. Oh my god, but yes, um, yeah, the suit pretty much bonds with Peter while he's asleep and pretty much controls him while he's sleeping. So when Peter, like, wakes up or whatever, he is overly exhausted. Add on to the fact that my man is goddamn, like, you know what I'm saying, overly aggressive. Yeah, it pretty much is like a, yeah. Bro, okay. bro, that is just freaky. I'm sorry, bro. That's just, that's like a horror, from a horror movie.
But yeah, it goes more in depth into it. Like, I think in like the symbiote Spider-Man comics because they act because in the um, in the original run when they showcased off the symbiote suit, they never really got they never went fully in depth with it. But bro, look at my man, he running, he running, <laughs> yo, that's insane. Wait, what was he talking about? Cat's out here. Bro, bro it's actually. Spider? It's out here making sounds though. What the heck? Spider, we need to talk. You're just gonna ignore me or what? Hello? You're not talking to me? Bro. Something's wrong. Bro. That's just freaking, bro. That's insane. What the hell is this supposed to be? It's the new Spider Man. Hey, that's pretty cool. New <laughs> Spider Man? Yeah. He's changed. I'll say. He's gone from looking like a brightly colored lollipop to a black suited criminal. At least now the city knows what he's really all about. What's that supposed to mean? It's obvious. With this new costume, he can go on mugging old women and hopping from vault to vault, and we won't see him coming. You don't understand. That's more than just costume. Easy, Ooh. bucko. Yo, Peter, you, Peter, you, you're showing off the aggressiveness, my guy. Chill. What's with you nowadays, Parker? Why so edgy? Just under a little stress. Stress. Welcome to my world. Now get out of here and get a little check on this brand. Damn! <laughs> yo! Yo, Davis, are you just gonna let that happen? Forget it. Oh, I saw the suit. It was going on. Oh my god. Oh, Jesus. Oh, it's just happening over and over, bro. Oh my goodness. Whew. Yeah, it has this little joyride night of fun, and then it pretty much just goes back. I don't even know why the Sibili kept on doing it. I think it was because it was trying to be, like, you know what I'm saying? Have some type of, you know, I don't know. It, it, the symbiote is a little weird. It's, it's crazy. Hello? Peter, it's Reed. Ooh, yo, we actually, we actually get to see uh, Reed Richards. Contact you for three days now. Three days? Yes, three days. No response, no sightings, nothing. I've been running a lot of tests on the sample I kept of your suit, and I've found some very dangerous things. Like what? Well, for starters, your suit is in fact a living organism. Shit. You to <laughs> now you're telling them, bro. It to a host, and from there, it tries to form a bond. It seems to be sensitive to certain sonic waves produced from sound. I need you over here as soon as possible for testing. Uh, okay. yes. I'll come right now. Yes, Look, finally. Okay. Thank you. Come on, let's go. Costume. Okay, Reed. Let's see you prove this one, smart guy. Oh. Um. Nah. <laughs> Bro, <laughs> Spider-Man 2 flashbacks with this. Oh my god. Damn! That's never happened before. Okay. Read about this. Hey! Hello. What is with this thing? God, it's almost like it's trying to stop. Oh, what the hell? It's attacking him? This thing is alive. Jesus Christ. Oh God! The fact that he keeps on surviving those falls is insane to me. But okay. Ah! Oh. I can hardly move. It's punishing me. It's trying to establish its dominance. Ah. Oh my God! Oh Lord! Sensitive to certain sonic waves produce your sound. Oh shoot! Oh, so this is how they did it. Because uh, for those that don't know, um, in the comics, in the original comics, anyway, uh, Peter got rid of it twice. The first time, obviously, was Reed. He was able to hand with the sonic, whatever. And the second time is actually this scene. With the bell tower. Oh, my God. Look at this. 
Again, again, I know the quality is, you know, not there, but bro. Woo! Yo. Not gonna lie, that was fire! Yo, Roger King, I'm sorry, bro. Dude, dude is ripped. <laughs> dude is ripped. Oh my goodness. Yeah, get the hell out of here, Simi. Nah, but I think, I think the Simi does do one thing. And nothing else it does in the comics as well. Is that it actually pulls Peter out of the freaking, like, bell tower. Because it was, like, sensing that Peter was in danger or some shit. It's How crazy. Can something that's nothing but help me try and hurt me all of a sudden. It's not possible. I found something that does care about the real me. You don't understand. That's more just costume. More well, that just thing costume. has, yeah, that thing has freaking emotions. It loves that day. Loves Peter. What the freak? Has a soft spot for my nigga. Look like hell. Basically was pulling it out, pulling Peter out of the damn like, bell tower and shit. So, this proves that that thing has a, some, I guess, love for Peter. Weird, but sure, you know. somewhere in this place like bro that's insane what the heck it is a way to connect with something bro he's someone it's all over now i've never felt this pathetic this shame and yet the fact still remains that the one person i wish i could reach out to right now wants absolutely nothing to do with me try scene six well, he's talking about, he's thinking about Mary J. Oh, Mary J. Okay, look, I, I know, I know a lot of y'all probably like, bro. Play, come on, bro, listen. But you some, of these, some of these actresses, you know, some of them, come on. Just don't understand. Especially back in the you olden days, you know what I mean? And why did you reach out in the first place? Why are you here now? Because I still love you. Well, then come back to me. Mary J., you all right? Oh, sorry. I just Ooh, got she was thinking about Peter. Cool. Do you want to start on? on? She was thinking about Peter, bro. Come back to me, Mary Jane. I think I made a mistake. Well, it's not important. We can just start on. No, I'm really sorry. I have to go. Mary Jane, what about the lines? She's about to go back to a Peter Pot, oh boy! Hello? Hey there, Tiger. Mary Jane? What? Whoa! See you back, boy! How are you? Can we talk in person? Yeah, sure, when? Right now. Um. Say less! Yeah. Say less! <laughs> Yo, she we love to see bro. this, bro. We love to see it! <laughs> So what about you and your exciting life? I'd hardly call working for J. Jonah Jameson all that exciting. Ah, uh, still lying. What? Peter, look, I did a lot of thinking when I was in California. I thought about my life, my dreams, my goals, everything. And it all seemed empty without you. I need you, Peter, but I need all of you. But, hey, say less, I'm no, be I'm here with it. Oh, she about to probably reveal to him the whole truth that she I knows. I don't understand. Peter. I know. You know what? I know about what you do. I know you're Spider-Man. Yes, sir. How? Back in high school, I saw you jump out of your bedroom window in your costume. So, 
You've known all this you time. You all this time, yeah. Again, like I said, it happened in the exact same way in the comics. Like, MJ already spin new Peppy from Spider-Man. She just was too afraid to literally announce it. I wanted to tell you. I really did from the first day it happened. But I couldn't risk your safety. If anything ever happened to you... I understand. It's okay. I just need to know how you feel right now. Are you ready to let me back into your life? Oh, absolutely! 100%! Do you love me? Pierce, say it. Come on. I always have. Thank you! And that's all that matters. We love to see it. Oh, we love it. We love it here. We love it here. We here with... <laughs> Oh, bro. Who's this bomb? Hello? Yeah, this is Brock. I got your page. Listen, I got a lead on that one story we were talking about. What? What are you talking about? Spider Man? I'm fired? <laughs> you can't fire me! <laughs> you, <laughs> you, what the frick is this acting, bro? Hello? Oh, wait. But that's that's weird. They never really showed it. Yeah, the whole thing with the, for those today. that don't know, it happened no in the comics. Here. Got it? Basically, Spider-Man uh, captured this this criminal like the Sin Eater, and the Sin Eater, Mr. James, uh, basically, Eddie Brock thought he caught the real senior, but in reality, Peter caught him paper. as Spider-Man. So, bro, it's just Line. insane. Line one. Speak! Hey, Mr. Jameson, how you doing? This is Eddie Brock. Uh, listen, I was calling in regards... Yeah, listen, Brock, you're done. Finished. You're a liar. A laughingstock. Ooh, fraud. If you so much as walk into this building, I'll throw you on the street myself. Damn, Jonah! A piece of advice. Find a new career, because you sure as hell blew it with this Mr. one. Jameson, understand, that wasn't my... Have a nice oh, day. Damn. Damn. Eddie Brock has been reported today to be a fraud. Spider-Man has, in fact, captured the true Sin Eater. Yeah, there we go. You know what I'm saying? The, yeah, for those of you guys that don't know, the Sin Eater, again, he was a serial killer, blah, blah, blah. All this other crazy shit like that. You know what I'm saying? It goes it goes deeper into the comics. I'm surprised that they never really covered it a little bit. Or even, they just, they just announced it just off the spot. This is crazy. Definitely turn me on. Oh, my God. Why? Yo, why Felicia out here eating popcorn on some Yo, what? Hey, Cat. Hey, Spider. So, what you been up to? Nothing. What about you? Well, I'm back with Mary Jane. Mm. Are you happy? Yeah. I, uh, I really am. Well, here. I made you this new suit. Ooh, yes, hey, sir! Yeah, I guess for, the guys, for those that don't know, Black Cat also created, in the comments as well, she also created the, a copy of the symbiote. Yeah, she probably could go. Yeah, me too. Take care of yourself, Cat. You too, Spider. I'll see you around. Well, I'm actually surprised. I think this is like the only time. I'm, I'm pretty sure I'm wrong. I'll probably go in more like deep with some of these other, like, like, you know, episodes, yeah. issues, whatever. Because I think it's the last. This is probably be like the final, the only time we ever get to see Black Cat. I believe that now. I don't think like we've ever got to see her in like after this. I may, I could be absolutely wrong. My mind is rage and glory. Ah! Ah! Ooh, it's time, boys. And pride. Craven. <laughs> Craven. I think I know what's going to happen in the next part. I am Craven. Oh! Yo, they. Oh, I. Oh my God! I so fucking remember. They're they're they adapted the last hunt. Oh my God! I love it. Meaning. Oh. Oh, y'all is not ready. Y'all is y'all is not prepared or ready for this. I have left behind my treasures. Abandoned my life of wealth to prepare for something more to prepare for the ultimate hunt craven is him i will catch craven is him bro i will destroy i am craven yo yo y'all don't y'all not ready I'm laying on y'all is not ready for what's about to happen in the next. <laughs> oh my God.
guys, that was it for Peter's Web. I hope you guys did enjoy this reaction video. You know what I'm saying? Again, I'm going to pretty much try and finish because, again, like I said, bro, the next... Oh, bro, you guys don't understand. Out of all the Spider-Man um, arcs and storylines that have been in the comics, this one undoubtedly needs a just... It definitely needs to just need a live action release. It definitely needs to like needs to be adapted into live action or animated, something like that. Because again, like I said before, many times over, um, and I'll continue to still say it. Uh, many of Spider Spider-Man has the most fierce storylines in comics. Period. And it's a such a flipping shame that. Some of these storylines, like at least one of them is adapted, and that was Spider Verse, obviously. But there are other storylines other than Spider Verse. There's the death of Ultimate Spider Man, there's the freaking uh, Back in Black, uh, like there, even in Craven's Last Hunt, which again, which in the next like issue, chapter, whatever the freak, the episode, next fan, the next part of the fan film, they're going to be covering that. And I, oh my god, again, 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 again. This is why I love Pierce Webb. It's peak for me. I still remember very vividly of what what was what was shown again, like I said, but again, it probably come back in full force with the nostalgia. But again, like I said, I, I really hope that after the whole Spider-Verse with what they what Sony does with it, that we will get into some of Spider-Man's, you know, traditional storylines outside of the whole Spider-Verse. Because again, like I said, Spider-Verse is hype. It's, it's, it's all right. But what I really need to see is some Craven Last Hunt at being adapted. Or the freaking, even the Superior Spider-Man being adapted. Because the only time the Superior Spider-Man got adapted was in the Marvel Spider-Man TV show that happened back in 2017. Which... The less I say about it, the better. Anyways, <laughs> like, comment. Share this video across social media if you can, and subscribe if you know my channel. This is Blue Sex, I'm always thank you guys so much. Peace!